This is a demonstration video of the Westminster record player. I'm just going to demonstrate it so you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. First thing to do is screw down the two transit screws on the deck. Here and here, screw those fully down clockwise so the deck floats on its springs and remember to unclip the arm. On the front of the two main controls on our volume and tone. On the deck you have the speed control here, stop start here and size detection automatic via the trip lever at the back here. So you can load between one and six records, I'll demonstrate with two just so you can see it play. Pop the records onto the spindle ledge and put the stacker arm across and turn the right hand control knob all the way around to start the auto changer. right hand control knob all the way around again if you want to skip to the next record. So I'll just demonstrate with the start of a 12 inch record as well. When you stack a 10 or 12 inch record this is the site selector lever so you need to make sure the record is stacked above the lever like so and that's so that the tone on knows to land in the correct position. the arm lifts off automatically at the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and just want to play one record manually at a time then you can just place an individual record down the spindle onto the platter. If it's a seven inch record you can leave the stacker bar in the upright position and select auto and the arm will go across to the seven inch position or select manual start and place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing, lower the stacker bar down so it knows to switch off at the end. If you leave it playing with the stacker bar left in the upright position as pictured here, that triggers a repeat function again for 7 inch only and the same 7 inch will replay over again until, until you stop it manually. So hopefully that covers everything for you, but if you do have any questions when you receive it I'll include my email address in with the machine and please use that method 